What's up, everybody? <clears throat> We're looking at the HTC Evo 4G. It's a new ROM right here. It's a, uh, this is a port from the HTC Desire HD over to the Evo 4G. Um, it's not a alpha or beta it's actually just an experimental ROM but I thought I'd give you guys a test run before there's a lot of videos up so okay we're gonna look at it is that the HTC lock screen okay we're on charge let's look at this again I, I want to show you the flip down clock it got the flip down clock that um It's a little new to the sense, so check it out. Okay, for those of you who didn't see it, let's look at it again. Okay, the sense clock flips down. And it flips down when you first start, and it flips down every uh, minute that passes in every hour. Okay. Okay, uh, a few things are different down here in the bottom. Uh, you got your your apps, your phone, and then over here you got this. Um, usually it was for add widgets to home screen, but now it's basically a personalized. Um, you got where you can do different scenes from HTC, which is, you know, where you can pick through your scenes right here. Okay. And you got the button to get more. You got your wallpaper here, which I don't have any live wallpaper, I don't think. Uh, okay, actually we got this one. So we'll just look at this one in the background. Um, let's see what else. You can add your widgets, and it got a list of your widgets, but you can also... Um, there's a HTC Browse HTC widgets, which you can go side to side. And this is super fast, okay? Or you can go up here and get more HTC widgets, okay? Like the normal stuff. You got shortcuts, um, notification sound, ringtone alarm. You can do all this from that uh, right hand button. And there's another thing, uh, HTC... Uh, skins okay this is something new these are skins you can put on your phone um and it you know this is the one we got now which is that one but it says get more and uh to get more you're gonna have to you're right stop to get more you're gonna have to sign into htc sense but um Doing that, man, makes it reboot your phone because, like I said, this has a lot of bugs in it. It's not really ready for everyday use, okay? But it's going to be pretty cool that the new Sense is going to allow you to um, to, to install um, different skins on your phone, okay? Up here at the top, you got your, your uh, notification bar and up at the top, this is something new too. It holds like what's going on like this one right here says connected to PC this is last call widget and uh, skin picker these are like the last things that you did so you can just quickly get to them uh, this is the regular stuff and another thing is notification matched contact suggestion okay it shows and you go to that and it's gonna show you people that matches uh, contacts that you have and you can push ok or you can dismiss all so I'll push ok and it's gonna load okay um, the phone, that's another thing that's pretty cool, um, let's see, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna show you this real quick, man, I'm, I don't really wanna call anybody, so I'm trying to find a number that's maybe been disconnected or something, <laughs> so, that way you can just see what it looks like without me really calling somebody. So, 
uh, trying to find a good one to call without really calling somebody, you know, so, if you hear stuff in the background, and if you're used to my videos, you know there's always kids making all types of noise in the background, so, uh, sorry about that, nothing we can do, they're gonna make noise, so, okay, I'll just call this number, just to show you what the new phone looks like, okay, You know, and the bottom looks a little different. Um, try to get a little better view of what's going on here. And if you notice at the top, the notification bar glows green. It glow. It glows green when you're um when you're. It's pretty cool. It glows green when you're on a phone call. So the taskbar at the top glows green. I thought that was pretty neat. Um, I don't have a lot set up on this. It has most of the widgets that you're used to. Friend stream, bookmarks, and all that stuff. And on my desktop, I don't know if you can see how I got my icon set up over here. This is a... Uh, this is a um, app you can get from the the market called Multicon and it this doesn't have nothing to do with the ROM but it's pretty cool too it allows you to install four desktop shortcuts where one app would be so you in essence can put a lot more stuff on there um trying to figure out I haven't been through this ROM like a lot because it's not a everyday ROM but um it is pretty cool so I mean you got your Twitter and it, it is super fast and um let me see if I can go in settings go uh, about phone system oh wait hold on. go to software information and uh, software information okay uh, says um, let's try to let's try to Android 2.2 um, the build number is a, uh, it's a, a, incredible does since so it's his build um, so it's not really the stock desire I mean it's his build he's changed a few things to make it compatible with the the Evo but it's pretty cool um, super fast um, looks a lot crisper. You probably can't tell on here too well, but it looks real crisp. And, um, you know, stuff works on it. Not everything does, you know. It's, that's going to happen because it's a port right now and it's not, it's not ready. But, uh, you pull those down and you can, you can see you can switch different things that you've done. Um. Market looks the same, obviously, because it has nothing to do with the ROM. Um, trying to think before. Uh, yeah, I can't. I, I'm sorry, I can't really think of anything else to show you guys right now. Um, a lot of stuff. If you do it, it will. A lot of stuff, if you do stuff, it will, um, force close, or it will, um, or it will restart your phone altogether, so. Yeah, this is how you compose your messages. It looks a little different, too, so. And, like I said, it's probably going to restart right now. Yeah, see, this is what I was telling you about. You push certain things and it restarts it. So, but I just want to share this with you guys. Um, if you want to take it for a test drive, if you're bold enough, then the download links will be in the details. Check it out. See what you think. See if you like it. If not, whatever. Leave a comment. I'm out.